earth signs hey my earth signs i'm back thank you guys for watching my channel she's got to get Taurus, virgos and capricorns i'm here to do an energy check in for you they told me to get you your messages out so here i am from these messages i ask that you please take what only resonates for you Taurus, virgos and capricorns and leave the rest right on where it's at and at any time you're watching this reading and it gets confusing click off because you are going you ain't gonna do nothing but get more confused if it don't belong to you it ain't it ain't gonna resonate with you period if you guys are seeking a one-on-one -on -one, i'll make sure to pin my website in the description box below that beautiful rose company they'll be posted right there as well and also don't forget to utilize the discount code this gift 40 you guys so at this time they still have a, a deal going on a sale going on you'll receive 60 percent for your very first time uh, ordering from them and then if you utilize my discount code which is gift 40 you'll receive 40 percent from me so go ahead and get those blessings out with it but energy check in for Taurus, virgos and capricorn spirit white light holy angels i call upon you to guide me thank you for your protection at this time please continue to protect me please continue to use me as a vessel no weapon be informed to come against us shall prosper Return to sender all black magic, evil entity, and that spell work being sent. Thank you. Messages for Virgo spirit. Energy check in for my Virgos. It's all love. And then it's all love. It's all love. That's what I'm hearing. I don't know what sign is on a little dirt. At the bottom of the deck, Virgo, you got property here, real estate and residence. Some of you guys could be thinking about moving or you just purchased a new home. Wallflower. Mm. You ain't a couple of you guys ain't even getting your way right now. But you need to know though that you hold all the potential. You withholding past life, knowing deja vu and past love. Are you holding on to a past lover here? Beauty queen, shining on stage and adored. This is giving um, Aquarius energy. Or somebody here is on stage, a platform is being watched or something like that. Show me more. Energy checking for Virgo spirit. Wallflower, limited, limited potential shyness and withholding. What is this? You're holding back from somebody right now. I feel like a couple of you guys too is trying to get somebody to notice you, but this person ain't even noticing you. Or right? somebody here ain't paying attention to you the way you want them to. Uh, it's like somebody is in front of you trying to get your attention, but you're not. You're not giving in, Virgos. Show me more, spirit. Will of Fortune here in the Seven of Swords. I also just heard y'all say it is what it is. The Will of Fortune here in the Seven of Swords. Some sort of like sneakiness. All right, this is your plan here. This is your escape plan with the Wheel of Fortune and the Seven of Swords. Somebody is like secretly explain, uh, secretly planning an escape. Show me more. I just heard I did all I could do. Somebody just feel like shit. I did all I could do. Four of Cups here showing up here. Ten of Cups. Uh, you feel like you did all you had to, all you could do here with a water sign? Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio? I feel like, too, a couple of you guys are bored because something came out and you had to end it about somebody's sneaky or deceptive behavior. And now you're holding back from this person, but this person is trying to reach out to you here. Or this person is trying to make their presence known, but you're holding back. But here comes the past person right here. So this is the person you're holding back from. What's up with this past love, spirit? Inside on this past love. King of Pentacles, Earth sign, masculine. Show me more spirit. You could be an Earth sign feminine. I'm talking to dealing with an Earth sign masculine. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Connection here. Yeah. King of Pentacles here in the Two of Cups. Somebody feel like they should have done the right thing. Give me one on the Seven of Swords. What was what was done? Give me one on the Seven of Swords. Five of Cups here showing up and a Page of Cups. So somebody feel like they want to apologize to you, Virgos, or they, yeah, that the right thing to do is apologize. Somebody feel like the, the cycle though is closed. They understand it now. They see a thing. They see things from a different point of point of view. This could be a water sign. Somebody is like really in their emotions over this shit right here, Virgos. Mm. Strong water sign, a powerful connection you have with this person, but you close it out. Hey, look, you got the you got this sneaky uh, this person here that that deceived you. They want to say. A, they apologize. Page of Cups here. And they and they feelings with the Five of Cups. They crying over spilled milk. I feel like it was this person that done you wrong first, Virgo. And now that you're just out there searching for peace and your happiness, this person wants to come back around. I also feel like, too, somebody is projecting on you. This past lover of yours, this water sign. Something about a powerful connection, though. Show me more. Show me more about this past love. Six of Wands. 
King of Pentacles here, Two of Cups, Six of Wands. Now somebody here is determined to make a connection work. Something failed with somebody from their past. So whoever they with right now, it's like they, they determine here. Somebody's determined to make something work. Give me one on this Two of Cups. Three of Cups, yeah. Somebody here is like determined to reconcile, okay? Why is Beauty Queen here shining on stage and adored? This could be somebody adoring you. You adore someone else. It's a feminine energy coming up over here. There's a masculine here in the middle. I feel like there's a masculine Virgo I'm talking to right now that don't really don't know what they want to do. They determined to get a connection here back, a powerful connection back. They determined to reconcile with somebody here. After some type of portrayal here has ended and everything has come to a close. Beauty Queen. Four Wands here showing up. Damn. Eight, four Wands, Eight of Swords here, and a Ten of Swords. And whoever somebody crushing on or whoever, because uh, I'm hearing that song, know that I adore you. Yep, baby. Whoever this is that adores somebody here or is infatuated with somebody, it ain't what it seems. Ten of Swords here, Eight of Swords, the confusion here and the portrayal is coming from this person that got you so far up their ass, Virgo. Or the portrayal coming from you, one or the other. Ten of Wands, told you. There's an end in here to all of this infatuation that you have with this person that you're dealing with. There's an ending coming. Something here was just like um, material. Something here was materialistic here about this whole connection. And now that that shit has went away, somebody is determined to get their past person back. They feel like this connection was more powerful than anything anyway, okay? So I'm leaving it there. I love you, Virgos. I hope this helped. If it did, please don't forget to hit the like, comment, and subscribe. You could be dealing with another earth sign, another Virgo, a Taurus here, or a Capricorn. You also got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpios. But overall, somebody is in their emotions. They feel like they, they let the materialistic and something, that the, the looks of someone here come between a connection or whatever this deceit was. They want to apologize from it. They sorry, and they want to move on from it. Love you. What's up, Capricorn? Energy check-in for my Capricorn spirit. Magician at the bottom of the day. Don't be fooled. Virgos, don't be fooled. Messages for Capricorn at this time, Spirit. Capricorn, you came up in a collective read. Messages for my Capricorns. You got boat here, receiving what you need, progression here, arriving and moving on. Somebody could be moving on close, but somebody has closure issues. Wedding ring, union, wedding, married, soul, connection, internal love, everlasting promise. Mm -hmm. Having a hard time moving on from something that you promised. Somebody from someone that you promised. It's like you gave somebody a promise here. And the only reason why they hold on, it's like clo it's giving closure issues. Someone wants to do the, someone want, like they feel they're being led here. They're being guided to close a, a cycle out, but they're having a hard time closing it. It could, because now I'm here, never make a promise that I can't keep. So somebody is in something because they in something. Look, at the bottom of the deck here, you got coffee cup. Meeting, okay. So you're meeting here, friendship. Something here about a, a, a certain person, Capricorn, that you need to talk to, or this person always know how to uplift you when it's time. So go ahead and have some coffee and talk to that person, okay, about these closure issues that you're having. But it says paradise at the end, happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other. Somebody is going to close out something so they can go towards somebody else. Who is this that's having closure issues, spirit? but they having a hard time. They know they want to do it. They know they want to get going. They know it's somebody else that they're interested or someone else intrigues them, but they still holding on to something. You guys could be married. It could be a soul tie, a long-term connection here. Show me more spirit. Who was having closure issues? A Taurus, Capricorn, a uh, Hierophant here showing up. Yeah, there's definitely, this person here is having a hard time because y'all married. I'm talking to a married ca uh, Capricorn. Look at the bottom of the deck. Higher from right here, Taurus Energy Capricorn, you showing up right there. Show me more about this. Somebody just feels like they're not doing the right thing. Two of Pentacles. The higher from here showing up with the Two of Pentacles. Show me more. 
I feel like somebody can't keep up with it no more. They've been trying to do this and juggle this person and juggle somebody else or juggle their home life. Because somebody is married, but apparently they want to sneak out and having a hard time doing it here. Knight of Pentacles showing up with the moon. Slow to give somebody else an offer. Pisces energy showing up. Taurus energy showing up. It could be another earth sign too. And somebody here got somebody in secret that they secretly want to go towards, but they have yet to make, they have yet to do it because of this. Why, why is wedding ring here, Spirit? Union, wedding, marry. Show me more. Death here. Scorpio energy, you know, Scorpio, but it's just time for a change. Okay. Somebody scared, is, is, is somebody scared of this change? Somebody feel like they put, they put too much time in it. Somebody feel like they invested too much in you for you to just walk out on them and leave them now. Another earth sign coming up. Scorpio energy showing up. Who I see is Taurus, Pisces, Scorpio. It could be another Capricorn, Virgo. Page of Cups. Yeah. Somebody like want to make it work. Show me more. Five of go here. Look, somebody is unap unapologetically telling someone that, you know, our time has come to an end. Just period. The Five of Pentacles, you getting rid of another earth sign or earth sign getting rid of you. Show me more about this spirit. Paradise, happiness. So you already know what you got to do. If somebody is leaving behind a, a marriage here. This Two of Pentacles, you're going towards somebody here that they've been going towards secretly for a long time anyway. Knight of Pentacles with the moon showing up. Paradise here. Happiness, expansion. Somebody feels like they, the secret lover is paradise. Show me more. Queen of Cups, told you. Somebody's secret lover is who they in love with. Someone is in love with their secret lover. And try, don't know how to close out or don't know how to get rid of this person that they married to. Eight of Swords here. Look, uh, uh, you got the Queen of Cups showing up. You got the Eight of Swords here showing up. And then you got the Knight of Wands. Um, whoever this other person is that's waiting on you, Capricorn, or if you're waiting on this other, it's like somebody here is confused. They know that you got love for them, or somebody know that they love you here, but the confusion is, why is it something taking so long? I feel like somebody here is impatient, but it, time is of the essence. Wow. Show me one more spirit on this situation for Capricorn. The lovers here, yeah. Somebody here, somebody connection over here. This could be a connection with a, a Gemini, a connection with a Scorpio, a connection with the Pisces, a connection with the Taurus. Look at this. Empress at the bottom of the deck. Pregnancies and fer fertility and all of that going through here. Somebody here needs to make a decision. Decision time. Uh, Capricorn, they want you to know that you need to make a decision, okay? Because at the end of the day, you need to realize or someone else needs to realize that this long term or this marriage thing needs to come to a complete close before you're able to do something else or it won't work. I love you, Capricorn. I hope this helped. Don't forget to hit the like, comment, and subscribe button. Oh, shit. Taurus. Oh, man. Taurus energy spirit. <laughs> My Taurus energy. What's up, Taurus? Energy checking for Taurus spirit. Somebody just needs to understand here that it, with or without someone, there's a must that you keep going. No matter how many times a motherfucker promised you or no matter what they promise you, you're always supposed to be ready, okay? You can love a person out loud, Taurus. I don't know why they want me to say it, but I am. You can love a person. It's, not, it's, it's giving. It's not what you do. It's how you do it. Because no matter how, no matter how much you try to hold on to a person, if that person don't want to be there, that person don't want to be there, babe. Okay? All right. This person, if you in here cross-watching for a tour, no matter how, what you try to do, no matter how many, much you spy in here, no matter how many times you come back here, okay? If the tour, no matter how many love spells you try to do, if a tour is here, you know, wants to be somewhere else or is destined for something or somebody else, then that's just what it's going to be. It'll never work out. Energy check-in for tourist spirit. Energy check in for Taurus. Energy check in for Taurus. Manifest here. Tell the universe what you want. So right now you're in manifestation mode. Sowing your seed, or you're telling you to sow a seed here. Date night. Get out and let your head down. Get ready to be winding down. So somebody here could ask you out. Show me more. Moving. 
Change of residence, moving in with your partner. Mm. Somebody here getting ready to move. Give it time towards everything in divine time and let things flow. Give it time. Who is this that's interested? Somebody's interested into you. Who is this that's interested into Taurus at this time? Get ready to be wine and dine. Here showing up, damn, will of fortune here, damn, knight of swords, whoever this person is, uh, Taurus, mm. they coming in with they feeling to you, they coming in with they heart, they coming in holding their heart to you, somebody here wants a new beginning, or like somebody here wants to start something with you here, king of cups showing up, will of fortune, knight of swords, Gemini energy coming up, Taurus, king, uh, um, I'm also hearing Taurus, another Taurus, I'm also hearing uh, cancer too, show me more, um, show me more spirit about this. Something here about this connection. Show me more. Come on. Get ready to be winding down. There's something about this person here. They give them mysterious energy. They can have Scorpio in their energy. I mean, Scorpio in their chart. The moon here showing up high priestess. I told you something here. Something deep about this person that's trying to come in and wind and down you. Because it's giving all of a sudden. They're like, what's up? Be careful of this person here that wants to wine and dine you. They rushing to do something. Are they rushing away from something? Pisces energy strong coming up strong. Show me more spirit. What's the moon? It's like whatever this hidden is, this person got something hidden and they keeping it to their chest. Like they keep laying this this is like a... They smile, they be smiling at you, or you have a whole civilized conversation looking at each other out from eye to eye, but they thinking about the secret. Are they like they, whatever this is that they got bottled up, it's something that they hiding. Or this person could just be simply hiding their emotions and their true feelings from you. Show me more on the moon, spirit. Ten of swords, so some type of betrayal or judgment. Damn. Mm. The worst is over with. That's what I just heard. I feel like they saying too, don't worry about whatever the moon here is, showing up with the ten of swords and judgment, because every dog has their day. What's this high priestess? Six of wands here, and then the magicians. So what they do? Ooh, Taurus. Somebody here uh, is into divination. Somebody here is a traveler too. Not night, whoever this is, that go to sleep, they travel. Virgo energy showing up, Gemini energy showing up, Cancer energy and Pisces is showing up out here. A little bit of Libra too. This, this, they saying get ready to be wine and dine, but I feel like you should be like iffy or like make sure that everything about this person, make sure that something adds up. It's like, I still, I can't pinpoint what this is, but I'm telling you energetically feeling this, something ain't adding up about this person. About this masculine or about this feminine. You know something. Look, the, the moon here showing up with the high priestess with ten of swords and judgment. They under judgment for something here. Be careful. I feel like somebody here is just here. Like, it's just a good time. It's like somebody here is trying to rush, though. Give me one on the twill. This was karmically meant to have happened. Happened anyway. Four of cups here, nine of cups. Yeah, they're saying um, whoever this is that's rushing in and let me take you out and let me do this and let me do this. It's best that you hold back from them and go, go towards something else. At the end of the day, you ain't going to enjoy this person. At the end of the day, you're going to find yourself not even intertwining or, or, or vibing with this person like you're supposed to because it's something up with this person. Why is moving here spirit for Taurus? Why is moving here for Taurus? Cherry, yeah, the cherry awaits you, my baby. Mm, okay, so this move here, this big move that you're doing, you could have Scorpio in your chart. chart. Cancer is very significant out here, but they telling you to get going, though. We're moving here. You got the cherry showing up with uh, death. So a transformation here is happening once this move takes place. So this was pretty simple. You already have your uh, daily coming out tour, so go ahead and watch that as well. If it ever came out yet, just, just know that it is. But, um... 
uh basically they just saying manifest what you want uh speaking into existence be careful what you ask for though somebody coming towards you wanting to wine and dine you and move in all fast but it's something iffy about this person they i, I strongly being led to tell you here too that there's something better or give your time your vibe your energy or whatever you got going on to, to someone else that deserve it i feel like this person just does not deserve your time but they are rushing towards you okay Taurus. i'm leaving it there Definitely you guys to find yourself moving in with a cancer or reuniting with a cancer here for sure. Scorpio showing up, Pisces, Libra, Gemini, Virgo, Cancer. Okay. I hope this helped you guys. If it did, please don't forget to hit the like, comment, and subscribe. And also, if you guys are not following me over on TikTok, what you waiting for? It's the same name. She's got the gift. Go check me out over there too. I love y'all and I'm going to tap in with y'all later. Okay. Peace.